It's yeah. a bit cooler than we might like, but thank you very much indeed. Now, while the men suspected of planning to blow up passenger planes are all British nationals, it seems their arrests were the result of a complex international investigation. Well, let's talk more about it with the BBC. Morning, Gordon. Good morning. Uh, we've been getting new developments actually out of Pakistan this morning, haven't we? There have been more arrests than even were initially thought there. Tell us what the rest, this, well, the, the latest arrests that we've heard about that, they were British nationals in Pakistan. That's, it is very significant on many levels that, that there have been the arrests in, in Pakistan, because as you say, exception has been that hasn't always been the case. Do your su sources suggest that, in fact, this cooperation is now working well? Thanks very much. We're actually going to be talking more about the impact of all of this mm. with uh, Alice Beer, the consumer journalism. She's going to be here shortly with uh, some advice for you if you are planning to travel. Yes, trying to make that journey as easy as possible for you this morning. Now it is 8.49 and uh, a slight change of pace here. Here's a taste of something coming up on breakfast next week. What have Liza Minnelli, Bill Clinton, Dolly Parton and George W. Bush got in common? No, I can't think of it either. It's, it's not a love of Broadway musicals, I can tell you. It's something much more socially relevant than that. So to solve the riddle, someone else who shares their trait is the former editor of The Sun, Kelvin McKenzie. He can reveal all. Mm. <laughs> There you go, mm. that's uh, happening next week, so uh, do look out for that. Yeah, we of course are not baby boomers. No. <laughs> well, well, I'm definitely some not. Some of us are, some of us are. <laughs> I some didn't want definitely to. Definitely not, but anyway. <laughs> now, back to the story of, of the terror alert, of course. You've been sending us your concerns and queries for the best advice on travelling on or if you were caught up in the disruption caused by yesterday's anti terror measures. Well, the consumer champion, Alice B.